his family too much. But I'm going to tell you, a lot of people may not know that, in fact, Colin's great-grandfather, Victor Mahoney, is in fact, officially, the father of bluegrass drumming. Now, I know a lot of you say, you're probably saying, there's not a whole lot of drumming in, in traditional bluegrass music. Well, that is so, that is so. However, Victor Mahoney 
was in fact Bill Monroe's first and only drummer. Back in the early days, yes indeed now. Now truth be told, Victor Mahoney only in fact made three shows. Uh, well, two and a half, really. He, got, he did get sacked uh, by Bill Monroe in his third show. And, uh, and this was because Victor Mahoney, Colin's great-grandfather, was a chronic uh, opium addict. And, well, you know, just not the most reliable character, frankly. But nonetheless, history remains the same. He is nonetheless Bill Monroe's first and only drummer, and therefore the father of bluegrass drumming. Now this means that Colin is his great-grandson and Colin is chosen to take up the crown, the somewhat neglected crown of his great-grandfather, to become the great-grandson of bluegrass drumming. And he is going to show you some good old-fashioned 1930 style how down home bluegrass drumming, ain't you, Colin? Hey, just like Bill would have had. Fahey, you did a wonderful opening set. And uh, Orange Marmont. I don't know who that guitar player was. I should have said that. Yeah, yeah, there was actually. Where was the vocoder? Fairpoint. Fairpoint.